Hey guys, this is Captain Unusual. Just making this video in the middle of the night. Yes, that clock is correct. It is actually 3.44 a.m. And just on the spur of the moment, I got this idea to compare the old YouTube to the new YouTube, particularly the channel page. And uh, I'm on the old, what the old format looked like. And I actually, as you can see, I have that saved as a favorite on my computer or on my uh, browser anyway, on Firefox, because I like the look of the old channel page better. And oftentimes, you know, that's not uncommon. And uh, I'm going to ramble a lot in this because, like I said, it's late. But uh, yeah, and also another thing is, as you can see, this is a very cheap. Uh, screen capture uh, software that I'm using so don't bitch about it it's just it's just what I use I just don't see the need to get a better one this one was free so it's the one that I'm gonna use but uh, yeah so I like how the photo I don't know what this thing about like on the internet on social media all the photos have to be circles now I don't I don't get that I, I like squares I like Squares look cooler. They look just kind of more professional, more kind of real. They have more of a basis in history. Photos have been square for, you know, over a century. So it just, just makes more sense for it to be square. And it just looks classier to me. Circular photos, they look more modern in a sense, but they look more mo more modern in the same way that, like, writing in all lowercase looks more modern like uh target's new logo where it's all lowercase or like iphone or haibu or uh, those new companies where it just capital letters are taboo all of a sudden for some reason yeah it looks modern but it also looks shitty so anyway and you can see my channel here and uh yeah Really, the main difference that you can see is in the uh, the top here with the with the photo and the cover photo, and the way that that's that is. So everything down here, it doesn't actually look too different. So, but we'll take a look at what the new what the new. Oh, it's over here actually. been a while since I've narrated a video. I'm not very fond of my voice, to be honest with you. I I kind of have the sort of the sort of a nerdy Midwestern accent. I'll stop that before my channel trailer comes on, but yeah. So and I do have it on uh, night mode, so that's why it changed. That's not part of the. Uh, the new channel page format it's just that on the new on all the new youtube i have it on night mode so that's why it turned black like that but see i don't like how the cover photo shrinks and expands like that i just would i would i would prefer it to just be static and like i said goddamn circular photo you know, I was able to, like, uh, edit the thumbnail so that it, so that the letters, the, the words still appear, the verbiage is still there, and the, you know, you can still see everything. But, I don't know, it, it just, uh, and it's so small, that's another thing, why is it so tiny? You know, you can't, you can barely even read those words there. Not that it says anything terribly important, but I put, I designed that photo for a reason. And you should be able to get a good look at it. You know, the old one was, you know, about as a square about that big. You know, you could at least read and read it and look and be able to tell what's on there. Like I said, the stuff down here, pretty, pretty much the same once you get down to that level. But everything up here is just, you know, and I also like how I, I with the old uh, format, I like how the verbiage is up closer to the top. 
At least I think it is. Hey, I'm tired. And I feel like complaining. But yeah, it's not down here. It's, it's sunken down here. It's like it's up here somewhere. So I like that better. I'm really going downhill now. I'm going to have to stop. But yeah, it's just not, it's not as good. I often feel like whenever they make a change to Facebook or YouTube or, or some other site, it's kind of change for the sake of change. Sometimes they do have big ideas in the works that are an improvement, but for the most part, I think it's just they shake things up just for the sake of shaking things up. The programmers need something to do, so they they propose, oh, we got to change it. We got to give it this new modern look. We got to redesign it. You know, it's kind of just an attempt to justify themselves most of the time, I think. That's my personal opinion. I could be wrong, but honestly, I think for the most part, it's really just kind of change for the sake of change. And one of my favorite sayings is, if it ain't broke, don't break it. Not if it ain't broke, don't fix it, but don't break it. It's, it's just, yeah, I know, that was my cat. And I'm not drunk, by the way, I actually don't drink at all. But uh, I'm just sleep deprived, it's 3.51, I should have been in bed over an hour ago. Yeah, I know. That's Zara. You can actually see her in in uh, some of my videos. So look for her. Say hi. All right, folks. That's going to be it for me.